Pisces, welcome to your September reading. Okay, so first card that we have is the Moon card. Um, we also have the Four of Pentacles and the Queen of Wands in reverse. I'm getting this month like you're really wanting to stay a bit more like inward. Um, whether it's like actually like you're just wanting to like be at home more and like, you know, I'm getting kind of just like cherishing being at home and wanting to kind of guard yourself. And um, yeah, also with this like Ace of Pentacles in reverse, I'm getting this month for a lot of Pisces might kind of be more like, like rest oriented. Um, obviously you have things you have to do, responsibilities and whatever, but then afterwards it's like, I mean, you're not doing anything extra that you don't need to this month, um, definitely because it seems like there's a lot of, like, emotional processing going on for Pisces and, like, something that you're doing deep reflection about. So it's like you're wanting to just kind of be at home while you process and go through this and, like, just kind of keep more to yourself. Um, yeah, it just feels really nice for Pisces to kind of, take a step back, whether that's like socially or whether it's like, you know, um, like hobbies or whatever, just kind of like, yeah, not for sure, not doing anything like extra, um, whatever, because also with this, like, uh, eight of cups in reverse and the three of wands, I'm getting it's like you really need this time to rejuvenate and to focus on something because so that you can have more energy for yourself later. Um, this could also be like you're planning something kind of big like maybe within the next few months, like the next six months, whatever. And so you really need some time to like, just like be within your own energy, within your own space that you can plan this more thoroughly for some people. Um, yeah. Yeah, also with this regeneration card, and many Pisces are really um, like rejuvenating, refreshing, regenerating their energy and themselves right now. Um, I'm getting a really good account out of the other side of this, like feeling a lot better this month. And also it's like, I'm getting a lot of uh, evaluation of like yourself um, and kind of maybe with this like three of wands, like maybe there are some changes you want to make in your life and so you really need some time to like take some deep reflection on yourself and also this treasure island it seems like there might be something kind of shifting in reverse it seems like there might be something shifting in your values and your priorities here and so maybe that's why you're like taking a step back from some things because it's like that's not as important to me anymore right now like I'm kind of wanting to take my life and maybe a lifestyle whatever in a different direction so it's like you're pulling back from some things while you like reorient. Hmm. Yeah, also we have a spiritual union. What I'm getting with this as well is that you um, don't be afraid, like, if you are, people really value you, like, for who you are, so maybe you feel like you need to, like, be a certain way, or maybe you're not as in, like, a super, like, joyful mood, whatever, like, you're not feeling like being that exciting, you kind of just want to be more chill, more laid back, whatever, I mean, maybe there's a fear of, like, people will be, like, bored of you or discontent or they're expecting something else of you. But these people really um, value you um, just for being you. So, um, yeah, it's like you're a lot more valued in a different way than you think. It's not necessarily what uh, you think you have to give to these people. That's not why they're around you. It's more of, like, a spiritual... Um, like union that you have with these people, connection that you have, like a like-mindedness is why they value you is what I'm getting. Interesting. Also with this hope card, um, if there's some kind of relationship in your life, maybe um, with this like discontent and boredom, discontent and boredom um, that feels like, oh, maybe you kind of get stuck in the same routine with this person or whatever. It's like things kind of feel like 
they're getting boring or whatever. It seems like there's hope this month of like being able to change a dynamic or a certain relationship in your life or to bring some kind of like novelty into it. Um, there's something that gives you some kind of hope about a relationship here as well. Um, also more generally I'm getting it's like this like changes that you're doing, this reflection that you're doing helps you to kind of um, gain some hope for the future, to have a better future for yourself. Hmm. Yeah, because whatever this thing is, it could also be like these things that you're pulling back from, you're kind of bored of, you're kind of done with. Okay, I also have an affirmation for you. So this is, today I'm free of drama. Today I'll let go of the people that do not support me and only surround myself with positive people. Um, so yes, this could definitely be something that you're pulling away from. This could also be um, an affirmation that you can use if you would like. So thank you, Pisces. That's all I have for you. I hope that you enjoyed this reading. If you like personal reading, the email's in the description. Thank you.